Hey, how's it going? As always, my name is Jay Snugabauer, and welcome to episode four of Living with the Virus. As you can see, I'm without a guest this evening. However, uh, I do have one more guest that will be coming on the show for sure, another roommate of mine. Uh, tonight he was unavailable, but we will carry on without him. Let's jump right into some new updates for the coronavirus. At this point worldwide, we have 1,697,848 cases. Lots of cases, number continues to climb. Death toll is 102,696, but our recovery is 376,254. Definitely something to keep in mind. If we take a closer look at our countries, well, the rankings haven't changed too much, uh, but definitely keep your ear open, uh, stay tuned. Right now, the top five are USA, Spain, Italy, France, and Germany. Yes, that's correct. You didn't hear China. China's actually the sixth country, so they've dropped out, which is great news. Obviously, they went through a six-month period where it was hectic. They didn't know what was going on, uh, how to stop it. Obviously, we still don't know how to stop that. But the good thing is, if we do practice our social distancing, the virus will lose momentum. If we do take a closer look at the USA, however, the US uh, continues to climb in numbers. Right now, there's 502,876 cases. The death toll is at 18,747, and the recoveries are at 27,314. So definitely come, something to keep in mind. Our recovered cases are, is higher than our death toll. And if we take a look into the United States at those um, individual states, well, the Northeast is still taking a hit but we will recognize that our top five uh, for those states affected hasn't changed. They're New York, New Jersey, Michigan, California, and Massachusetts. If we do take a closer look at New York, however, New York is at, t at a total of 172,358 cases. The next state, New Jersey, only has 54,588. So New York has definitely been impacted by the virus. Their total deaths right now are 7,844, and their new deaths in the past 24 hours are 777. So I think the answer is right in front of us, and we simply have to act as American citizens. We need to practice our social distancing, uh, stay at home, only go out if necessary, and if you can, only send one person for that specific job. Like I said, um, you know, apologize for not having a guest this week. However, this social distancing thing kind of hinders who I can select from. But with that in mind, we will have a guest next week. And my roommate, uh, can't wait for you to meet him. Have a great evening. As always, episode three, Living with the Virus.